I'm Jake Bruton and today we are at our Hilltop Aero House and I'm in the basement and I want to talk about insulation. Today when we're talking about the insulation down here, you've seen this Halo Intera product in a basement insulation video that we shot here already and you'll remember that that insulation dives down and then we poured our slab against it. So the slab is broken from the concrete on the outside. The question is, how do we transition from this to the upstairs wall insulation and to that exterior zip insulation? Well, the solution is easy. While we're trying to not use spray foam anywhere that we don't have to, we also know that there are some places that are just the best place to use spray foam and it is the best product to use in that location, the rim joist being one of them. So here, what we've done, this insulation is actually fairly loose on the top side. So one of our carpenters came through and put all these little scraps that we picked up from around the job, just shoved them all the way over and put a screw in it. That's now held tight to the concrete. And then the spray foam contractor will hit the bottom of our subfloor, down the rim, across the little bit of exposed concrete and tie to the top of this Intera, locking it in place after it dries. We'll come through, zip these screws back out and our insulation will be held tight to the concrete at the bottom by, by our concrete slab and at the top by our spray foam. And now we have continuous insulation from underneath the slab all the way up to the bottom of that subfloor. And then the insulation starts again in the wall cavity and we have that R9 on the outside. Everything is one continuous envelope, making this space warmer, making the floor upstairs warmer and making this stuff stay in place without having to come through with fasteners. All we had to do was put up like 20 of these little blocks to hold it tight. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram. It's jake.bruton on Instagram. Don't forget to check out all the other videos every week on the Build Show Network. Thanks for watching. <laughs>